Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa and I'm the owner of SeasonAndServe.com. Today we are continuing our holiday series here on my channel and we are doing another Christmas tree decorating video. For this Christmas tree today we are going to be decorating in a beautiful gold, silver, and white color palette. And it's definitely going to be a little bit more on the glam side, but I think it's going to look really nice and it's going to go with the rest of the decor that I'm planning in this room. Now this is actually a bonus video in my holiday series this year because my previous video when I decorated my main Christmas tree went over so well and you guys enjoyed it so much that I decided to do it again with you guys this year. So super fun, two Christmas tree decorating videos, which is pretty awesome. So if you missed my previous video when I decorated my other Christmas tree in a beautiful cozy cabin Christmas theme, definitely head over there and check that out after this video and I will leave that linked in the description box below. And now for this Christmas tree, we're going to switch gears a bit and we're going to go for a more glamorous style. And the main colors that I'm using in this Christmas tree are gold, silver, and white. So it's going to be very clean looking, but also very modern and glamorous. So I'll start off by showing you some of the decorations that I'm going to use for this Christmas tree this year. And we have ornaments, we have ribbon, we have floral picks, we have a bunch of stuff. So I'll show you that and then we'll get into decorating. And of course, don't forget, if you liked today's video, please hit the thumbs up button down below and also hit that red subscribe button for more Christmas decor videos and for lots of Christmas recipes. There's going to be tons coming out on my YouTube channel and on my blog, so make sure you follow me there as well. With all that said, let me show you the ornaments and we will get into decorating. All right, and here are some of the ornaments that I'm using to decorate our tree this year. As you can see, lots of gold, silver, and white. And the majority of these I actually had from previous years, like these ones and these ones. The only new ones that I got this year were these four. It's sort of like a metallic uh, mercury glass sort of style. And then also these beautiful white ones. These look super beautiful and they have little beads on them. It sort of looks like ice. So it's really cool and I'll show you what it looks like on the tree. But yeah, the majority of these I had from last year and most of my ornaments I get at HomeSense here in Canada. So. I know it's kind of hard to find the same thing from year to year, but you might get lucky. You never know. And here are our ribbon choices. We have this beautiful gold ribbon that I used on our tree last year, and this looks super beautiful. So I'm thinking about using that again. I also have this really nice silver glittery ribbon. That's really nice as well. So I might do double ribbon or I might do triple ribbon. I don't know because I have this really nice double-sided ribbon. It's silver on one side and gold on the other side. I actually got this from Costco, which is really amazing. So, hmm, we'll have to see about the ribbon situation, but I think with these choices, it'll look really, really great. And then I also have some floral picks here, and these I got last year from Michaels in Canada, and they're just like really, really beautiful. This one has like really nice magnolia shaped leaves and some berries, and these are just smaller, sort of like champagne colored berries that are really, really nice. So, I think all together it looks great. Now we gotta see what it looks like when we put it up on our beautiful Christmas tree. And then for a tree topper this year, I did get this brand new this year at Canadian Tire, but it's a beautiful sparkly gold sort of snowflake looking tree topper. And with a sparkle, I think it definitely makes it really glamorous. So we're gonna try that out this year, but I think it already looks really nice. And then with all the other decorations, I think it's gonna pull everything together perfectly. And so with that, let's get into decorating. To begin decorating the Christmas tree, I'm gonna fluff out every single branch on the Christmas tree to make it look really full. And as you can see, just as I started doing this, the lights at the very top of the tree went out, so I had to have David help me fix it. And he just ended up having to replace a bulb in it and everything started working again. Now that the tree was all fluffed out in full, I started adding the ribbon. And I began with the silver ribbon and I added it in long pieces, but I found this was really difficult to add and sort of manipulate and maneuver into the tree the way I want it. So I actually ended up cutting the pieces into shorter ribbons to nestle in throughout the tree. And as you can see, this did take a fair bit of time of me placing the ribbons and then moving them around. But if you're adding wired ribbon to a tree, this is sort of the process that you go through. So you just gotta be patient and work with it until you have it the way that you want it. So as you can see, after I did the silver ribbon, I went in and added the gold. And then on top of that, I also went in and added the double-sided ribbon as well. So we are really sticking to the silver and gold theme for this tree. And even at this stage with just the ribbon on the tree, I really liked how it looked. It looked really glamorous and also made the tree look really full as well. 
But we're not stopping there. Now we're gonna add our floral picks to the Christmas tree. And I'm using the bigger pieces near the bottom. And then I like to kind of take one and cut one up into smaller pieces just so that I can use the smaller pieces near the top. So it looks like everything flows throughout the tree but is also well balanced. After I added my really large floral picks, I went in and added all the berries and those are pretty easy and I didn't have to cut any of those up because they are relatively small. So I placed those evenly throughout the tree as well. And now we're on to my favorite part of decorating the Christmas tree and that's adding the ornaments. And I like to add the more intricate ornaments first and get them all placed where I like them. And then I go in with more of the plain ornaments and fill in all the different blank spaces. And as I was decorating the Christmas tree, I realized how much I actually really love this color combination of the gold and silver and white. And the gold and silver I think is pretty classic, but when you're adding the white into it, I think it makes it a little bit more modern and a little bit more fresh. So I think this is a really great way to sort of modernize your Christmas tree is just to add a little few white touches and make it look extra beautiful. And then once the whole tree was decorated, I added the star on the top of the Christmas tree and just wired that in. And now for the big reveal. And that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button as well as the red subscribe button below, plus the notification bell to get notified every time I post a brand new video. For some more holiday decor and inspiration, head over to my Instagram and give me a follow there. Also, make sure you check out my blog to get a head start on your holiday meal planning this season, plus lots of delicious fall and winter recipes. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in my next video.